the world is shocked by the doomsday storm. Kaaba was blown away by the wind. The earth is getting warmer and the climate is changing more and more. Muslims in Mecca in particular and around the world in general are constantly worried about the safety of Kaaba. A series of floods, storms and winds with speeds of up to hundreds of kilometers per hour are slowly destroying Mecca. Even the important pilgrimage of Muslims is interrupted when extreme weather events are taking place on this global land. The government is constantly looking for solutions. The Muslim community is constantly praying for Mecca. What if the safety of the Kaaba is not guaranteed? How things will change? Let's explore the fierceness that Mother Nature brought to Mecca and pray for the Kaaba. In today's video, our channel always finds out and updates the latest discovery, so don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell to see as soon as possible. Don't take your eyes off the screen. Let's get started right now. Severe storms ravaged Saudi Arabia, causing widespread damage. Saudi Arabia faced a barrage of severe lightning storms and powerful easterly winds, resulting in extensive destruction throughout the country. A fiercer storm hits Mecca in Saudi Arabia. The wind knocked people down and toppled heavy metal structures. The National Center of Meteorology has issued a red with a warning in the province and some areas of the kingdom. Several videos shared on social media showed pilgrims rushing to find shelter, while staff at the Grand Mosque were almost overwhelmed by gusts of wind carrying large trash cans. The footage also shows flooded streets and cars almost completely submerged. Saudi Arabia faced a barrage of severe lightning storms and powerful easterly winds, resulting in extensive destruction throughout the country. Mecca, Jeddah and several other regions bore the brunt of the turbulent weather. Numerous dramatic videos capturing the tempest's fury circulated on social media, illustrating the relentless force of the winds, which were potent enough to dislodge heavy plastic barriers. These gusts also posed a threat to Umrah pilgrims at the Grand Mosque of Mecca. We also can see the storm's severity, including the collapse of power poles amidst torrential rain. In various video clips, electricity poles precariously leaned over roadways, providing a stark depiction of the unstable weather conditions. Saudi Arabia to see torrential rain, thunderstorms and flooding in the Mecca region. Heavy rain has been recorded across the kingdom. Mecca has been hit hard, with rainfall drenching worshippers in the great mosque of Mecca's courtyard. Saudi Arabia was hit by severe lightning storms and strong easterly wind, which led to widespread damage across the nation. The stormy weather's brunt was borne by the cities of Mecca and Jeddah, as well as several other regions. What the storm brought affected the Hajj pilgrimage of Muslims. This is one of the important rituals of Muslims. The Islamic ritual is obligatory for every able-bodied Muslim adult who has the financial means to take part, forming one of the five pillars of the religion. The annual pilgrimage began on Sunday in Mecca, Saudi Arabia, with the Tawaf, the circling of the Kaaba in an event that is expected to break attendance records. While an expensive ritual, the journey of Hajj often inspires hope for many, even if they hail from parts of the world besieged by war, poverty, or occupation. Many save what little money they have for years to be able to afford it. The physically and emotionally challenging experience is meant to cleanse followers of sin and bring them closer to God. The pilgrimage draws Muslims from around the world to Mecca in Saudi Arabia, where they follow in the footsteps of the Prophet Muhammad and relive the journeys of Ibrahim and Ismail. The Kaaba was originally a center of polytheistic worship by pagan Arabs until the arrival of Islam in the 7th century, when the Prophet Muhammad began the Hajj pilgrimage. 
Muslims do not worship the Kaaba, but consider it. Their holiest place and a powerful symbol of unity. Wherever they are in the world, Muslims must face the Kaaba in daily prayer. The Hajj pilgrimage has been held every year since then, even in the face of wars, plagues, and other uncertainties. The storm in Mecca raises concerns about the safety of the Kaaba. It is easily affected by weather conditions. Situated in the heart of Mecca, surrounded by believers from every corner of the earth, stands the Holy Kaaba, a cube-shaped, inspiring monument that embodies centuries of reverence and devotion. Believed to be the house of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the Holy Kaaba is a sanctuary of tranquility and a pilgrimage destination. Muslims globally face the Holy Kaaba when they perform Salah. It is important to remember that Muslims pray to face the Kaaba and not to it. The Holy Kaaba was initially constructed by Prophet Adam, then by Prophet Ibrahim and Prophet Ismail, and lastly by Prophet Muhammad. In addition to being the site for the pilgrimage such as Hajj and Umrah, the Holy Kaaba is believed to be at the center of the world, physically and spiritually. It also represents unity and showcases that all Muslims are one in the eyes of Allah. The story behind the door goes back to the era of the Prince of Mecca Sharif Masood Idris bin Hassan when Mecca suffered from the flood. Because of the heavy rain, the holy mosque sank to the level of half the wall of al kaaba Consequently, the northern wall was knocked down. The eastern wall, which holds the door of the Kaaba, was also affected by the rain. The Sultan ordered the governor of Egypt, Muhammad Ali al-Albani, to take necessary and urgent measures to repair the Kaaba. Sultan Murad also sent a special delegate to follow up the construction work. The engineers decided to demolish the eastern wall of al kaaba and rebuild it again, since it was too old and couldn't survive another natural disaster. The Egyptian engineers have mastered the creation of the Kaaba's door. They divided it into two shelves and decorated it with geometric shapes plated with 166 pounds of silver. The rest was coated with Benedict gold, which is suitable for creative designs. Special metal sheets with high quality and durability were used to resist climate factors. The magnificent design survived for four countries at the Eastern Wall and was only replaced in the Saudi era. In addition, the threads are dyed and woven into the cloth with the help of high-end machines. After this process, the fabric undergoes vigorous physical tests to ensure its strength and durability to withstand all environmental factors throughout the year. However, nothing is impossible. Kaaba still has to suffer from the result of climate change. Nowadays, on world maps showing the projected impacts of the climate crisis, the color red often dominates, symbolizing the most extreme conditions, the biggest risk or the highest danger. Millions travel to Mecca in Saudi Arabia every year to fulfill one of the five pillars of the Islamic faith. The Hajj, a pilgrimage to the sacred city every Muslim who is able must take. But the physically demanding experience, which requires long walks and sleeping in tents in one of the world's hottest cities, will become more dangerous for pilgrims as the planet warms, a recent study found. During the Hajj this week, temperatures in Mecca hovered between 100 and 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Ordinarily, more than two million Muslims from around the world gather to perform rituals like the symbolic stoning of the devil, circling the cube-shaped Kaaba, and walking between the two hills of Safa and Marwa seven times. But Mecca, a desert city located about 40 miles inland from the Red Sea, can be a perilous place for large outdoor gatherings and physical activity. Winds blow humid air from the sea into Mecca, which combined with the sweltering desert heat 
create conditions that can lead to heat, exhaustion, and deadly heat stroke. Red alerts already exist in Saudi Arabia. That means extreme events will happen regularly. Images of floods, storms, and thunder often appear in the lives of people here. Not only that, but other extreme phenomena can also occur. Tornadoes are one of them. No one wants to live in fear because tornadoes can come at any time. The Holy Land of Mecca is facing frequent natural disasters due to climate change. It's not like this phenomenon has never happened before. Yes, Mecca has faced devastating tornadoes before. Residents in Saudi Arabia were left in shock after a massive sand tornado swept through the Taif area, leaving destruction in its wake. Videos circulating on social media showed the moment the tornado moved across a field, devouring rocks in its path and sending huge billows of dust into the skyline. Debris littered on streets in the aftermath and vehicles appeared to be left in ruins. Unbelievable footage shows a tornado ripping through the countryside near Taif, Saudi Arabia, as a powerful western disturbance wreaks havoc. Now dangers are still lurking around the Kaaba. A tornado could strike at any moment and destroy the Kaaba. We need to be ready to prepare for the worst situation at any time. Do you worry about what day will happen? Let me know your thoughts in the comments section. We are very happy to hear from you. And that's all about today's video. If you enjoy this video, please give us a like. Don't forget to subscribe and follow us to update interesting discoveries in the world. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video. Goodbye.